chopping the old putty out of uh, window frames. It used to be a regular job when I was younger, uh, but now everybody has toughened glass and plastic windows. We don't seem to get to do it anymore. However, I have some of these Victorian window frames to uh, reglaze, and all the putty needs chopping out. So I thought I'd show you how I do it. Now, uh, I never thought much of the tool sold for the job, which is called a hacking knife. And I don't even know where mine is. Don't even know whether I've still got it. But this has been my uh, favourite uh, tool for many years. I get an old chisel, sharpen it on uh, three sides. Now I can use this chisel in any direction. want to be too sharp because we're not doing any cutting we're just uh, forcing the putty out it doesn't always come away as easily as this sometimes you have to fight for every little bit that you uh, remove I sharpen it to an angle of about 45 degrees which I find to be ideal and if you don't happen to have a powered scraper, uh, the best way I've found of uh, cleaning the bottom of the rebates out is to get the stoutest chisel you can find and use it like a scraper. Just like that. So with the box sashes, the uh, lower pane is held into the uh, middle rail in a groove and it's very difficult to get a chisel in there especially when you get to the edges if the uh, frames are uh, glazed in the, in the uh, Georgian fashion so I've made this uh, special chisel just for doing that job. So when you're doing this job you really ought to wear a mask and uh, make as little dust as possible because uh, even if the putty doesn't contain lead and uh, I'm not convinced that it doesn't because they used to put um, lead in paint as a dryer now I've taken uh, Georgian putty out by before now, which has still been uh, soft and green in the middle after oh, 150, 200 years. Uh, yet this later putty, the Victorian putty, is hard and crisp, so it may well have lead in it. And uh, 20th century putty, early 20th century putty, uh, had asbestos in it uh, quite commonly. So. Uh, Make as little dust as possible.